Hi guys and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. So today we're going to be learning how to build the fairy swordfish slash sea fox and the reason that I've amalgamated these two I was looking at the two designs for these um, and really there isn't too much different in them. It's, there's kind of only minor differences in, in them and when you actually put it into Minecraft it doesn't really work. Um, I actually I basically came up with the same style for both. So this is actually kind of, it can be worked for the fair, fairy uh, swordfish or the fairy sea fox. So, it's kind of like a nice little biplane, which is also a kind of seaplane that was used on quite a few different things actually. Um, it's quite a famous craft, or not famous craft, but famous plane. Um, and it used to have like a torpedo right in here. Uh, and you could, if you wanted to, put something in there. I've just left it off, um, just because it didn't quite look right. Uh, but you can put something in there. Maybe you can take out the floor and put it in there, but instead I've got the floor down here so you can actually get inside. That's where you'd have a pilot seat. And you've also got a back gun on it as well. So I've put that on there. Um, so, uh, kind of materials you're going to need. It depends on kind of what colour you want to make it. So, here I've got my kind of text pack, and I'm using LD Modern, which is my own text pack. The link is in the description as always. Um, and this one's made out of the cobblestone. What I'm going to be making it out of today is actually the sandstone. I'm going to try it in that, see what we kind of come up with with this. Uh, so you're going to need a slab, stairs, and a full block of whatever the kind of colour you've got. You've also got, you know, quartz blocks, never brick, stone brick, you know, everything. You can you can just do any of those free. Uh, you're also going to need a block of iron, fence gate, and fence. You're also going to need a button, and you're also going to need a never brick fence. So quickly what we're going to do is I'm just going to switch to the default texture pack to show you guys that are on the console versions or pocket versions what it looks like in that. Okay, so this is what it looks like in the default texture pack. Still looks completely fine and still looks like a nice little seaplane. Very, very, very simple and a nice little design. So I'm just going to switch back to my texture pack and we'll get started on the tutorial. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're just going to lay down these kind of bottom uh, pieces here. Uh, there is also, for both of these versions, the actual one with wheels on it as well. So I'm going to be putting on these parts which are like the floaty bits that um, obviously when it lands you can land on the water, get picked up by a crane and then put onto the ship. Um, so obviously you can put just the normal ones if you wanted to have it on land. I'm just going to go one, two, three. We're going to have a block gap and go one, two, three. Right on the front we're going to have an upside down stair. And on the back we're going to have two slabs. One, two, one, two. Now what you're going to do and I'm just going to grab an iron block for this. We're just going to go back by one block. So where we've got this kind of stair we're going to go to this next one. Just put in a block here for the time being and put one behind it. We have an upside down stair here and an upside down stair here. Go on to the other side, do the same. These are the actual little kind of connecting in parts. We're going to have two slabs in here. And if we go around to the back, we're going to add an extra two. And then what we're going to do is off this side kind of front stair here, we're going to go five. One, two, three, four, five. And then the next one's going to be four. One, two, three, four. Go to the other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 1, 2, 3, and 4. And then what we're going to do is if we come to the front, we're going to go forwards off this block and just have a full block of whatever colour you've gone for. And then we're going to have a piece of iron, a button on that, fence on the top and also on the bottom. And then on each of these sides, we're going to have the fence gate. Place those down, put down your fence gate, just like that, that will complete this section. And then if you grab your stairs, just put a stair going on these sides here. I'm going to go count on that one, one, two, three, four, and then the fifth one we're going to turn around like this. Same on the other side, two, three, four, and then the fifth one gets turned like this. Right here we can actually put in a stair here that will cover up that tiny little hole that we've got here. So we can put that in. Now on the back of that we're going to put three blocks, one, two, three, then an upside down stair. And now here we can put a normal stair, on the other side we can put a kind of normal stair there, that'll create this roundish part. Now on this lower part here, we're going to just on the back go two. We're going to have one. Create a little tailpiece there, so you got two, and then one, like that. Now we can always put in the gun as well, and you can either have a stair here, or you can have a full block. I just put in the actual stair. You're just going to put a fence on top of that. Fence gate goes here, and then you have another fence gate here, which gets punched out. That will give you closest we can get to at least to a gun. If you now grab your never brick fence, we're going to put one, well we're going to put two here, like that, two here as well, and then on this side part here, we're going to go from this longest bit, we're going to go one, two, then on the third one we're going to put never brick fence as well going up too high, 
Same on the other side. One, two, three. That just goes in here like that. Grab your sandstone slab, and then all you're going to do is mirror exactly what you did on the bottom layer. So it's going to match up exactly the same. So you can just drag this all the way top, uh, across the top now. Just like that. And, oop, there we go. I'm placing slabs everywhere, but that will give you the kind of roof part. And that will actually pretty much finish up the plane. As I was saying, that's super simple. Uh, what I'll do now is I'm just going to show you guys what you can probably do to to kind of put the wheels on it itself. So if we just grab black wool and also buttons, this will give you a variation. I'm just going to take these parts off completely. There we go. Take that off. And there as well. So I'll probably put a wheel right at the front here. Put a button on it. Put one there. Put a... well, don't put a button that way. Put a button on, the, on it there as well. And we're also going to need one for the back. Now, usually with the real planes, when they actually lie down, they would actually be at an angle. Because we're in Minecraft, though, it kind of makes it a little bit different. So we're going to have to grab never brick fence. Now I'll put one here. And then we'll have the back wheel. So that's how you make the actual wheeled variation as well. So you've kind of got the seaplane version, and you've also got the wheeled one. Really simple design. Uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the tutorial. And if you have, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one.